wonderful God, powerful God. Just lift up your voice and begin to pray. Let me hear you. Let me hear you. Rapa in the name of Jesus, lift up your hands. Hey, Ampara, Nyami, no, ye. Ampara, Nyami, no, ye. Oh, no, tea. Moma, yam, fana, say. Mano. Ampara nyami no. One more time. Ampara nyami no she. Thank you, Jesus. Ampara inside, outside, sing nyami no ye. Yeah, no tea. Mama, some fun say. Yami no anunti mofa na se ampara nyami and so heavenly father in the name of Jesus thank you for the privilege we have to come before your presence one more time, oh God. May your grace be strong within our midst tonight. And Father, as this service is labeled grace for academic and career excellence, let there be grace available. In the name of Jesus. As you have always proven in our midst that indeed only you are God. One more time, do it again. In the name of Jesus. It may grace fall, or fall upon every student, every worker, in the name of Jesus Christ. May all the glory be unto your living name. In Jesus' mighty name. And the saints will scream a bigger amen. A better amen. A better amen. Clap your hands all ye people. Do it better for Jesus. Yes, Lord. Oh, glory. Say bigger amen. Um, tonight, I want to take a special time. And for as many are available, such as students, workers alike, this is your moment. Say, this is my moment. This is my moment. My career. My career. In this season. Shall receive grace. Shall receive grace. Shall receive grace. My academics. In this season. The grace of God. The grace of God. Will fall. Upon my academics. Like never before. In the name of Jesus. Clap your hands one more time. Mm -hmm. Semi bie manua. Nami dia mi bo. Paya. Pecha. Uosru. Na uni. Ye yame. Semi pie manua na media mi bom paya meja osu na oni ma enye ye irati ma enye ye in my career in my academics ma enye ye. Me nyam ye ma ye yo hey osua warauni ye 
Aye, ye, ye, ye. Me, I'm ye. In my career, my ain't ye, ye. Ye, ratty. My ain't ye, ye. Sing with me anywhere you are. Oh, my ain't ye, ye. Me, I'm ye. My ain't ye, yo. Oh, 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 Warawunim. Yeah, my yeah, yeah. Me, I'm here. In my academics, my energy. Erati, my energy. My energy. Me, I'm here. My energy. Hey, oh, sure. Yeah, warawuni. Oh, my yeah, yeah, yeah. In this same ministry, we saw last year a young man. He said he sent over thousand five letters <laughs> to different schools and professors. He was done with school, and he had this prophetic intuition that. He's supposed to advance his academics. And then he sent over 1,005. Guess what? All rejected. Hmm. My God. There comes a time where you must hit the wall and come back to God. Say, Amen. 1,005. His video is here. We'll show it maybe this Sunday or next Sunday. He was sharing his testimony. He, he got tired and sat down. On the altar, I didn't insult. Oh, so I miss you. Wara wuni, ma brabo imo, ma enye ye, mi nyami. Masa, if you are here tonight, <laughs> God is here. I said, God is here. I was just going through the testimonies such as we received last year and then I was like, wow. Is that how God works in this ministry? It's so amazing. The reason why in this season we need grace for academic and career excellence is that your strength is not enough. I said what? The students, what you've learned is not enough. I'm telling you. If you see and hear people failing, it's not because they are dummies. Some of them are very brilliant. But something beyond their strength is happening. But in this service, oh, grace will speak. Say grace will speak. Shout grace will speak. Shout grace will speak. And so, hear me carefully. Let me give you the outline for tonight's service. Short, then we'll leave you this place. Listen to me. The first thing is that I'll exhort you for, for about 10 minutes. Then, we will take testimonies. <laughs> Last Sunday, I taught you that one of the ways to build your faith is through the testimonies of the saints. So you are here, maybe you were in the first year, final year, whatever. As you sit down and listen to the dumbfounding testimonies that God has done for your brother, your sister, your friend. It will challenge you. It will massage your faith to rise for a miracle. Then after, we will take three prayer points. Say bigger, amen. amen. One for career, one for the student, and then one for your future establishment. Amen. Say bigger, amen. amen. And then I pronounce on you a blessing. Amen. Then on at breakthrough night, this where you have you get a white. So this twenty sixth of this month, yes, breakthrough night. You have take this instruction because take it. Now those who are workers. You want to, you are believing God for a juicy appointment. Eh, for a salary you never dreamt of. Remember one man came to this church 
Atria, he said, when he came to Atria, he prayed that he wanted to receive what? A salary of an MP. And by the time we came back to the mountains to testify, he came with what? The testimony. He said, big guy, amen. That time, he was receiving 18,000 CDs. Within, a, no, within eight months, we went in January. Then the September, Gido Bakataya, God heard him. When he came back, he was taking 18,000. So we got here, man. We have seen in this church people receiving jobs in what? Saturday morning. Saturday morning. A word of God came. Prophecy. Bam. Then Saturday morning. Who gives jobs? Saturday morning. Something is about to happen to you. So hear me. As we hear people testify, do what? Connect. My father, I call. You know, I don't play with, with testimonies. You don't. No, you smile. Where they smile, you smile. After that, you do what? You chew it inside. Father, if you can do it for him, for her, it's my turn. Say, big guy, amen. So, that's the order for this. So, now, so breakthrough night. Now, the students, this is what you do. As we do always every year with massive testimonies, which you will hear some right now. Now, this one, you won't write it on paper. White handkerchief. You will write the what? The courses and the marks you want. The grade you want. White handkerchief, you write inside. Then the breakthrough night will bring it as a banner. Let his banner be raised. Let his glory. Oh, let his banner. Be raised, let his glory. We will celebrate. So, now, those who have applied for masters and PhD are like you write the school, the school names in what in the in the what in the handkerchief. Write the school name there and, and add it full scholarship. No partial. Let his banner be raised. Let his glory. Then those who are trusting God for what? Hear me. Some of you. Now, you don't, you don't have a job now. It's because you are thinking local. God ought to have what? An international appointment. Do what? Write it there. International appointment. And then breakthrough nights. We'll do what? As we wave, God will be speaking, and I'll be speaking to you. Are you here at all? Lift up your hands right now. Yes. Inside, outside, hands up. Close your eyes. I'm giving you one minute. Pray. Why are you here tonight? Just pray. Present your case to God right now. Lift up your voice. Present your case to God right now. Present your case to God right now. Present your case to God right now. In one minute. Yeah, pray. Present your case before God. Yes, so far, keep. In the name of Jesus, take your seat quickly. Let me exhort you 
just 10 minutes. So for time me, okay? Time me. I shouldn't go beyond 10 minutes. And then we'll take the testimonies and then we pray for God's people to receive the grace to excel both in academics and in career fields. Say big guy, amen. Quickly, quickly. There are a few things I'll bring to your notice. Then we're taking, we're taking the testimonies. The first thing you must know as a child of God that is very crucial for every child of God to succeed in every field of human endeavor. It is very crucial, very compulsory for every child of God to succeed in every field of human endeavor. Jesus wants you to succeed academically. He wants you to succeed in politics. He wants you to succeed in leadership, in governance, in business and industry. Jesus wants you to succeed. There's no father unless he's a wizard. There's no father who will be proud telling people that, hey, thank God though, my son has been repeated. Unless he's a wizard or an occultic man. If you call God our father, God will not be pleased. He won't be excited to see us failing. There's no one who has ever thrown a party for his children. What is the reason? Because they are failures. They failed in their exam. And for that matter, he is happy and he's throwing a party for friends to come. You, you, you will never hear that. Every father becomes very proud of their children. When they see them doing well. If you are here, you're not, you not a child of God. Good for you. In fact, I'm not talking to you. You are, you are in the wrong place. I'm talking to believers. Children of God. Who have given their lives to Jesus. They are those I'm talking about. But the others, God doesn't care. God doesn't care about your life. He's only giving you mercy to live that you may have sense and survive and repent and he will save you. But I'm talking about people who call on the name of the Lord that it is compulsory. It is a crucial matter for you to, solve, to do what to, to excel. God delights in your excellence. God takes joy. He takes joy in, in you excelling. So in scripture, we have people that excelled. That God took pride in them. And so if you are here in academics, as a student, God wants you to do well. If there's first class, God wants you to take it. Say bigger amen. Say better amen. amen. Never let anyone deceive you that because you were, you were a Christian, that's why God, I'm serving God. That's why. Who told you? It's a lie. If you're a Christian, a child of God, you are expected to make a mark everywhere and anywhere. Say, big guy, amen. We have people in this ministry who are making marks in academia, doing very well, whipping white men and white women at the same time. And so we have people we can refer. And this ministry, we have seen them in this ministry, left to abroad, God, they became the best student in, in their, their department, their faculty. Just last month, a member of this church that traveled, when, you, when he got there, he, he went to the, the uh, University of Oklahoma, construction management. He became a candidate that represented the whole school, the whole, the whole school. All the states in America, they came together for a quiz. He came second. Say, bigger, you man. Man. We have been showing to you, I mean, videos last year of members becoming overall best in their area of expertise. So if you are here, don't settle for less. This commission, we don't do what? We don't settle for less. 
That's why we are taking time on that today. We want to do what? We want to pray aggressively. I want to pray grace on your head that you do what? You will excel both in what? Academics and in what? And your career. So God wants you to do what? To excel. Why? He is a father. And no father is proud to see his children failing. No father on earth will be proud except the person is what? Is a wizard. And thank God our God is in what? Is in a wizard. So God wants you to do what? Wants you to prosper and succeed. Sepika, amen. We saw in the area of business a man called Abraham. The first businessman that did business in the God way. Abraham was a nobody. Then God called him. He became a child of God. And then in the book of Genesis 13 verse 2 on the screen. Genesis 13 verse 2. This Abraham who was called with nothing. That an Abraham was very rich in cattle, in silver and in gold. He became very rich. He did business in cattle and he prospered. Did business in gold, he prospered. In silver, he prospered. He became a man doing a man in the business sector with God. He became what? Number one. Became number one in business. If you're here, you're a businessman, businesswoman, hear me carefully. It is possible to become number one. Become what? Doing business with God will take you very far. Say, bigger amen. Abraham, we saw Abraham. This is a child of God, yet he became very rich in business. Cattle business, he was rich. Gold dealing, gold dealer, gold dealer, he was prosperous. Silver dealer, he was prosperous. Abraham. Then two, Isaac. Isaac, book of Genesis 26 verse 12 to 14. Then Isaac sold in the land. That's a farmer. A farmer. A farmer. Isaac became a farmer. And he sold in the land. And received in that same year. An hundredfold. Listen. Say receive. So meaning it was what? It was given to him. Who did it? God gave him. He received. A hundredfold. And the Lord blessed him. Continue. Verse 13. And the man was great. And went forward. And grew until he became very great. Say, hey. hey. This is a farmer. Chief farmer. Who was a Christian. A child of God. We are seeing what? We are seeing him God making strides. My God. Who told you because you are a Christian you should fail? That devil is a bastard. You are seeing. Verse 14. For he had possessions. He had assets. He did business through farming. And he was blessed to the point that he had possessions. Of flocks. And of herds. And great store of servants. And the Philistines envied him. The whole nation envied the man. One man. One man thousand. The whole nation envied him. My God. That's a child of God. So if you're a child of God in business, you are, I've given you what? I've given you references. Kingdom businessmen that made money, prospered, did well, became number one in their area. One, Isaac and his father, Abraham. Job. Job one. Job one. Job one, quickly. There was a man in the land of Uz whose name was Job. And that man was perfect and upright and one that feared God and is still evil. Verse 2. And there were born unto him seven sons and three daughters. Continue. Verse 3. His substance was also 7,000 sheep, 3,000 camels, 500 yokes of oxen, 500 she asses, and a very great household. So that this man was the greatest of all the men of the East. A Christian. A child of God. The East. You know the East? That's where we have the sultans of Brunei. This, in this era, we don't add it to what? First magazine. Because they are what? Worth in what? Worth in trillions. Sultans of Brunei. My God. The Arabians. Prince Sheikh Atani. 
my God, if they cough, you will die, sir. Money. And that a man was there in that same land. He was the greatest of all the men in the East. All the Eastern corridors were shut down for a man called Joe. He feared God, an upright man. Maza, the, the days where Christians would do muke, muke, muke. Oh, God will do it. Has passed. This is in, is by force, by, by what? You must succeed by all means. Say, bigger you may. Why? Because you are a child of God. Clap for Jesus right now. In academics, a man called Paul. In academics, academics. There was a dangerous man called Paul. Paul. Now let's go to the scriptures. Let's see what the Bible says about this, this Paul. This Paul. Let's go to Acts 26, verse 24. Acts 26, 24. Now, this is when Paul, the lawyers of the nation, came against Paul, put him in what, a tight corner. Lawyers against one man. Now, listen to their report. And as he does speak for himself, that's Paul. When Paul was speaking for himself against all the lawyers, all the chiefs, all the kings, all the masters of the law, Paul against them. Listen. Festus said with a loud voice, Paul, thou art beside thyself. Much learning doeth make thee mad. I want another, another version that can be plain to us here. Paul, that when Paul was, he was quoting things, he was speaking in dangerous mysteries of wisdom that Festus said, too much learning has made you mad. You learn too much. You learn too much. Paul stood, but Paul stood his ground with all respect. Festus, your honor, I'm not crazy. Nah, 24, right? Ah, my friend, hey, God help these people. Suddenly, first two shouted, Paul, you are insane. Too much steady has made you crazy. Too much steady. Say, shh, shh, shh. Too much lies. Say, Say too much lies. Hey, hey tomorrow eh, or Tuesday or this week. Go there what over what prepared what prepared. Prepared. To tear the paper what the paper over prepared. Too much learning. Hmm. 25. 25. Then you give me message too. He said, but Paul stood his grounds with all respect. First to your honor. I'm not crazy. I'm both accurate and sane in what I'm saying. It's like telling your lecturer that you, you are wrong. <laughs> in academies, we have men who have what? One, one man thousand. Lawyers were humbled in their number. This semester will break records. Say, yeah. because amen. Yeah. Hey, any faculty, department that you belong, college, you will break records. Yeah. Ah. Break records. Best female student in the whole faculty, the whole department. <laughs> Say, because amen. Yeah. Too much studies has made you mad. Why? What he, what he was saying, they had no understanding. He was deeper than them. My God. Hey, this week, the students, as go to write your exams, become deeper. Say, big guy, amen. Hey, they call you for interview, they're in trouble. You, eh, you will lecture them. You will educate them. The panel. By the time they finish, they have learned something new. Say bigger him here. Clap for Jesus. Yes. That's your portion. That's your portion. So Apostle Paul was what? An academic juggernaut. A dangerous man. His head they torn. 
the tongue. The head is hot. Too hot. Hey, you are here. Having the Holy Spirit. Say, I read, I don't, I don't understand. Who told you? It's because you, 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 you don't tap into the power. The power of the Holy Spirit. Shh. The earth. The brain in my head. Be useful. Hey, be what? Yeah, it'd be useful. How dare you that I'm reading this I'm, the, the same slides three hours. No way. Be useful. Capture it. I warn you. Capture it. But fast. Please, some of you see, you are too mukesh or too muke, muke, muke. Hey, hey, no. You blast him tons three times and say, hey, brain, be useful. God made you, and in this season you are useful. Yes, Capture the answers, my friend. So, my friend. <laughs> Say amen. Cap what you said right now. Ah! Say! Say big guy, amen. Please hear me carefully. Your heavenly father wants you to succeed. Say big guy, amen. Never allow this exam put fear in you. Workers who are here, it's about time you aim higher. Aim what? Leave all this, all this, two by four jobs. Aim higher. Father, WHO is there? Father, I'm here. You, ha you have a need there to address. I'm here. Who is there? Remove them. I'm here. Send me there, sir. You and Lord, you have, you need a Holy Ghost tongue speaking person there in UN. I'm available. What are you saying? Shaguda bagada kiko koko ka. Hey, I'm there. Say bigger, yeah, man. Are you ready to pray? Are you ready? Are you sure? Yes. So workers, students alike who are here today, there is grace. Too much grace available for you. Say bigger, yeah, man. Oh, hala hala, too much grace. Hala, too much grace. Why? This is because God wants you to succeed everywhere and in anything you do. Say, bigger, amen. amen. God is pleased. Your father won't clap for you, won't kill God for you because you failed. The same is with God. God is not pleased when you fail. And this is what I'm saying. We have been breaking records, but this one, it will be massive. <laughs> Sad massive. So take testimonies. Open your ears. You will see some proof. Some of them will display what? Before they join the church, they are resource. And when they join, they are resource. We'll let you know there was a declaration on this altar on someone. At the end, his resource. I remember that young man. The guy who became the best student, best is it, uh, mechanical engineering, whatever. David. Oh, where is his, his friend? Uh, where's where's Richmond? He's, he's in the crowd. Okay. So his friend, I, I don't know where they were roommates. So he said, okay, okay, my church. <coughs> we they go, we they pray, we they show. <laughs> and sometimes, let's go. I'll be hearing testimonies though. Now the guy came with on, on a scholarship. When he came that time, Miss Semester, he said he had what? Single numbers. Single numbers. Oh, six, four, three, two, one. Miss Sam, first year. Whoa. So he came to the service in April like this. And then when we close, so he had people, people te testifying. I came to this church, blah, 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 blah. So when you close, I said, okay, I'm seeing first timers. He came. What's he shook my Ah. Go and write it down that God will do something for David. He says, Sir, I'm David. I said, Go. He went. God's people, he came here to testify. He became the best what? Mechanical what? Engineering student. Best student. Received the award. Say, Big guy, man. Received the award. This is the same man who was, same guy who was having three, four, five. You have seen several testimonies. Please open your ears. As you hear, receive it. Tap into it. Lord, this is my turn. 
And when we stand to pray, hear me carefully. It will be your turn. It will be your turn. It will be your turn. Scream amen. Scream amen. Scream amen. Clap your hands right now. Yes. Please. So right now, all those with testimonies, software key will come here and co- please, we don't have much time. So when you come, st- just go straight up. What has God done? God made a declaration, it happened, whatever. Just make sure you go very fast. Sofo, can we welcome Sofo Aki? Uh, yeah. Sofo Aki, yes, young con, yeah, in 10 terms. Two, two, yes. two, 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 try two, two. Okay. So please, if you have any testimony academic related, please rush to me. As they are coming, let's be clapping for them. Let's be clapping for them. And some people have written down their names here. So we have. Prophets, Evans, Priscilla, Derek, please let's be clapping as they join us. Ezekiel, Kofia Samoa, Grace, Pedro Santi, Probia, Eric Labo, Philip Trimberry Makwao. Please, if you have your name, can you rush to me? Can you rush to me? Let's be clapping for them as they join us. Please kindly rush out. You have a testimony. God has done something for you in your academies. Yes, rush out, rush. We don't have time. Yes. All right. And we have some also documented here. So as we listen to them, we will take some of the documents. Okay. So will, so will you appear on, appear on the screen for us? To appear on the screen. Okay, okay. Right. So you tell us your name straight to the point what God has done for you in your academies. I testify. This must be God. Please, can you kindly put the microphone closer to your mouth so we can hear you? On Tuesday, I went to the campus to go and... Now, your results came. And by the grace of God, when you checked, you had what? First class. Can we clap for Jesus on that one? Yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. And on Tuesday, I went to campus to go and study. So, 3 a.m. I was tired. And so, I wanted to go to the hostel. And our hostel is very far from campus. So, when I went out from the campus, We thank God for that. Yes. So first class, yes. Clap for Jesus Christ, yes. I guess this must be God. Uh, so last year by this time, we had a service, Sunday service like this. People were um, giving testimonies about the academic excellence. So I tapped into it and I prayed to God that God, I want an increase in my Wait, what's family. that sound going on in the all right. Please, can you can you start again? Yes. So, so last year, last year, service like this. Yes. Yes. I, you I heard, came. Yes. Yes. And then I heard people testifying about their excellence in their in the results. So I will give him your microphone. Come. 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 Yes, young call. So um, I tapped into their what um, their testimony, and then I prayed to God that I want an increase in my CDOB because I didn't start well. It was that week. So fast forward, there, we went home. I prayed to God. I wrote my results. Though the results I wrote uh, wasn't what I had, but when it came, I had increased by five. Whoa. So, you came here last year, a service like this for students, and then you heard people, people's testimony, and you connected and you prayed. And then by God's grace, when he came, you have increased by five. Can you clap for Jesus? Yes. God bless you. Yes. Please, I'm Ezekiel. I testify. This must be God. Yes. I joined this commission when I was in first year by V.C. Aki. And he promised me of academic excellence. He promised you, hey, that if you join this church, you you do well, hey, and you believed him. 
as he came, I gave him one minute to teach the word. And he obeyed. So I trusted him on everything. Okay, so when he came to I said, a full penny. Oh, no, I'm going to pay you for one minute. So he gave him one minute to preach. Yes. And, and he finished preaching in one minute. Yes, one minute. Okay. And he invited me. And he said, when you come to this church, you will increase. Hey. Yes, in my academics. Okay. So I joined from first year. I was not studying. I was moving on campus, roaming Elta Skelta. Hey. Aquaipa. <laughs> not taking my academics serious. And God being so good. All the time I've been increasing. I've never decreased before. Since you joined the church. I've never decreased before. Since you joined, you have always increased. Yes. Are you sure? Yes, between God and a man. I've never decreased before. So my, uh, my colleagues who are studying, they've been reading all the time. They'll be like, ah, what have I been doing? I've been sleeping. Ah. <laughs> From here, don't sleep again. Go and learn. Please let no one take this and say, okay, okay. Oh, we all sleep. Don't sleep. Uh, from here, go and learn. So yes. I've come to return all these glory. Oh, I can you clap for Jesus? I should keep you this here. I like it like that. <laughs> can you clap for Jesus? You know, wait. You know, he was there and then a uh, sophomore came to his room. Okay, fine. Okay, let me but to ch for church. So okay, I'm giving you one minute to preach. Then one minute he finished preaching. It's okay. Now, the church you're about to join, when you join, academically you will increase. He said, eh. and since that time, he said, he has always increased. Uh, but don't take the one he said, he, he didn't learn. Don't take that one. I testify. This must be God. Please, my name is Prince Boshabochi. Um, last year, we had the opportunity to write the uh, marks you want for the exams, the grade, but I did not write the grade. I wrote the actual marks on my book then. I did not actually have faith like that. I thought people who had been getting the A's and those things, like Loki, the Abrilla, that's why they've been getting. So I just wrote. Wait, so we'll talk to about to about You said what? I said um, we are given the opportunity to write the grade. So write the grades you want. Yes. yes. But I didn't write the grade. You I wrote, wrote the marks. The marks I wanted. Okay. Uh -huh. So um, our results came. And I've been forgotten that I've written something down. So just last two weeks, I was going through my book, um, the one I've been writing, the things we learned in the church. So I went and I saw that ah, I've written something here. Then I went and compared. I showed it to my friend. And I went and compared. The same marks I wrote. Hey! <laughs> It's, it's even here. It's here. Now listen. I said this will happen at what? Breakthrough night. Get a white handkerchief. Write the grace there. So, um, this way, the marks I wrote for special because I, I, didn't, I didn't know what I wrote. I just wrote to see three, 3, 7 to 1, 8 to 8 to 3, 7 to 5. And it showed exactly You know, what, what year? What year? You know, he came for the service and we said, write the grades you want. Attach every course you are taking that semester. And he didn't write the words, the, the grades. He wrote the words, the marks. And he, guess what? 63, 71, 80, 83, 75. Mention them too. 63, 71, 80, 75. Hey! Can you clap for Jesus? And by the grace of God, I, I forgot to write my dissertation, but I also have 70 for the dissertation, my project. Work. Can you clap for Jesus Christ? At breakthrough night, you will write. And it will show, it will show, it will show. It will show. I testify. This must be God. Okay, I'm Derek. Last semester, Daddy told us to write our courses and the grade that we want. Okay. Last semester. Yes. yes. In a service like this, 
I say you should write the, the courses and the grades you want. All right. Okay, by God's grace, I increased by six. You increased by six? Can you clap for Jesus? So I'm here to return all the glory back to God. Oh, glory to God in the highest. So quickly. Who is Prophet? Hey, is that his real name? Prophet Ado. Prophet Ado. Or Prophet Ado. Okay, you share, share on your behalf. Yes. Quickly, sir. So, is it on the screen? You want to screen for us? Prophet. Please quickly help us. So, we go. So, his testimony was he had, in, in all, he increased by 15. 15! Can you clap your eye? Hey! So this is please wait and let him explain. Okay. I hope I hope it's it's it's, it's on it's on your it's on your, your your screens. Those outside I hope it's on your screens. Please can you can leave up the light so that we, we can see well because as same scene. Yes. Please, okay. So, for, I don't know if they can zoom it. Can they zoom it? Hey, Asemini. So, please, go ahead. In fact, this is even for another person. No, go back to the, the young man. What's his name? Prophet Stone. I don't know whether they have that one. But, okay, for this one here. Speak into the microphone, sir. This one here, the person got CWL 47 after taking, I mean, the semester results were released. These were the results here. Look at the first, the initial one, the before. D, B, D, F, D, B, M. So before the word came for the, for the service as this, before the person came for the service, the, the academic breakthrough service, this was the, the results. The result. He had D, B, D, F, and B. Yes. That was what the results. And he had what? 47.07. Yes. That was... CWA. CWA. Before the service like this. Before the service like this. like this. Okay. When he came to the service like this, as it. others have came and wrote, wrote, wrote the, I mean, the marks that they want, the grace that they, they want, yes, and prayer was made. Yes, okay, let's go. The results were released, and the after one shows his results. So that's B, 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 A, B, A. Hey! The increase, yeah. And now the, it's jumped from 47.07 to 60.5. Hey! Wait, wait, wait. The person increased in the semester after the prayer. 13. By 13 in the semester. Can you clap for Jesus? Shout he! Now, just watch on the screen. This was before he joined the church. Before he came for the service. That the prayers were made. D, B, D, F, B. Then 47.07. He even trade one. And then he came to the service as you have come like this. With the 47. And then prayer was made. And B, 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 A, B, A. Increased by 13. Hey, you are increasing now. Right, there's another one too. Yes, sir. The person, I think they will show you very shortly. The person had CW of 42.78. Please, can we see it quickly? Media. Media people, please. We don't have time. Do you have 42? Yes, 42.78. That was the person's what? The person's CWA. CWA. The service like this, the person texted the church um, WhatsApp number and asked, Are we sure of the testimonies you have been sharing in service? And I said, Oh, we are very sure of the testimonies. And when the next semester's results were released, she had 
she had increased from the 42.78 to 59.27, which also shows an increase of 16.29 or so. 16. So for Mr. Asemba Tobona, Nian Kasemo, but also saying, Sanka be a minty. So just speak, speak, please. She has increased by 16.27. No, what was her former results? Her and former then was 42.78. 42.78. Uh -huh. And now the CWA is 59.27. 59.27. Hey, 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 can you clap for Jesus? Yes, how about the, the prophet guy? Media team. Yes. What was his name? The prophet guy that you mentioned. Okay. So for young court, time of court, yes, yes. The, and I'll have some documented ones here. All right. So this is the, the lady who had the 42.78 before a service like this. And then after the service, 59.27. Hey, can't you clap for Jesus at all? Right. Then you have some academic, so I'm reading. So, media team, testimony number four. Please, you can only, okay. All right. Testimony number four. He says, I testify. My main prayer point from the beginning of the year was that God will help me with a full scholarship for graduate studies. I kept praying and connecting my expectations to the altar of dumbfounding testimonies. To the glory of God, I got a full scholarship to study outside Ghana. And I saw God's hand, God's power throughout all the processes without stress. <laughs> Secondly, some of the courses for the semester were challenging. I kept praying for God's hand and he has been faithful. I was able to work on my assignment, quizzes, and exams successfully to his glory. Two of the results are in and have strong A's, hoping for the best for the rest. And I'm here to return all the glory. Can you clap for Jesus? Full scholarships with excellence, excellence, excellence. Yes. Testimony number, the next one, please. He said, my sister and I made I join CYM after completion of my, of my senior year education, senior high school education, and told me to connect my results to the author of dumbfounding testimonies. Please, to my very surprise, my results were released on my birthday, and it was a success beyond my expectation. A prophecy was also released about an attack on my life by the devil when I was reporting to school as a freshman. And I want to say thank you to God for giving me success and preserving my life. Glory! Yes. The next one. Next. I testify. This must be God. It says, I had a dream some days before the release of my second semester results and that it was disturbing. Fast forward, after the results were in, I noticed a strange D grade on one particular course because I knew since I am in Christ, Old things had passed away. Quickly, I sought inquiries from my friend, which resulted in reducing my faith. So I contacted God's servant Hansel about the issue concerning my results after I contacted the lecturer. And God's servant told me it will return to my good. One month later, to be precise, along the way, joining CYM, I went to check the results on my portal, and the grade D had changed to grade A. From, from 42 to 78. Say! And I'm here to return all the glory back to God. Please, the next one. Please, please, next, next, next. Time will call, yes. I testify. This must be God. I'm a prospective third year petroleum engineering student. I give all the glory to God for last semester's results. Papa asked us to write the marks we want to get for the courses in the semester. And to the glory of God, Everything I wrote on paper is exactly what appeared on my results slip. Hey! And I give God all the glory for his mercies and favor in 
such a stressful semester. And a very big thanks to Papa as well. Amen. Please, next one. So this is an increment by 13 plus. Okay. I think that was, that was what was shown. Okay. The next. next one. I testify. All my life in KNUST, I had never crossed a CW of 60. I had never had 61 and above, except the COVID time, where we were at home copying each other's work. <laughs> <laughs> But these results came, and for the first time in my life in KNUST, I had 62.24, which is to me a miracle, and I've come to return all the glory back to God. Please, the next one. The, all right. I testify. Testimonies. When I got admission to KNUST this year, I couldn't start on time due to financial issue, issues. But then, a scholarship foundation came to my rescue. I reported to school after the first semester, mid-semester exams. And unfortunately for me, I couldn't meet the criteria of the scholarship. A friend invited me to this commission, and I told him about these issues, and he recommended I join CYM and connect to the altar of downfounding testimonies. I joined CYM as he suggested, and through the power of God and the Holy Ghost, the foundation called me for an interview. By God's grace, they decided to consider my upcoming semester results for the scholarship instead of the previous one. Kai. The director of the scholarship has agreed to grant me a full scholarship. Full scholarship? Here to return all the glory back to God. Please, the next one. So for kind, so for kind, two, two, what, what is this place? Yes. I testify. This must be God. I'm here to return all the glory back to God. During my national service, I embarked on a professional career journey, ICA. By the grace of God, I passed seven out of the eight courses. I was given. I wrote it again in March 2023 and still failed. Hey. All hope was lost because combining work with this exam at that time was the most difficult part. Fast forward, I decided to sit in July 2023 with the aim of just getting the pass mark of 50 and graduate because I wasn't getting enough time to learn. Always, I will be connecting it to CYM. When the results came, I got 77. And I was even awarded as the overall best student in that course. Advanced taxation. Advanced taxation. The overall best student. Overall best student. Can we clap for Jesus? That's in Ghana. Yes. In Ghana. In Ghana. Overall best student. Best student in taxation. Can you clap for Jesus? Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Software, yeah. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, I think they have some, I mean, video, video, video testimonies too. That was shared some time ago. Can we, can we play some, maybe two or three? I testify. Yeah, like, this must be God. Uh, I'm here to testify of how God saved me from writing a receipt. In third year, second semester, there is course we did. It's full of proofs. And then in the examination, we're Wait. giving seven proofs. It's full of what? Proofs. Proofs? Yes, please. P as in P-R-O-F-S. P-R-O-O-F-S. Yes, please. Proof. Yes. God punish the devil. Go ahead. Because I'm doing mathematics. Eh? What's it? Because I'm doing mathematics. But yeah. Yeah, man, see Yes, please, daddy. In tertiary. Yes, please, daddy. God will help you, sir. Amen. <laughs> so apparently, when we entered for the, the mid semester, we were giving us three proofs. That one, I couldn't do it. And I was hoping to do the end of semester. And the end of semester, we we're giving seven questions. Each question is 10 marks. That one, if you don't know, you don't know. <laughs> it's not MCQ that you choose A, B, or C. And there's a system as to how you should prove it. You should state that this particular person said so. This person said so, then in that order. So if you are wrong, you are wrong. I read a question from question one to seven and read reverse from seven to one. <laughs> <laughs> but still, the thing was not working. But I just ended up speaking in tongues. And the questions I answered, me myself, I knew that it didn't go well. So I was just praying and believing God for mercy. One day I was on campus and I received a call from my instructor. And was like, where am I? I said, I'm on campus. I should come to his office. When I went there, he showed me a list of results that proved that we didn't do well at all. Only a few people could pass the course, of which I was one of them. I had an F. Before he showed it, I had an F. So he asked me, 
Uh, what can we do about it? I was just praying to God, God, mercy. And he said, what said you attend? I said, I attend the Lord Shepherd Ministries. Kai. He said, okay, you, I'll add 15 marks to yours. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> what set do you attend? Yes, please, Daddy. And you said, the Lord Shepherd Ministries in And he said what? He said, I'll add 15 marks to yours. Masa. And that was how come he added 15 marks to my previous marks and I escaped the trail. And I'm here to thank God. Can you clap for Jesus? I yes. Testify. This must be God. Uh, please, my name is Joel, and then I'm reading biochemistry. So uh, that's last semester. A service like this before exams, and then I was ushering outside, and Daddy came outside and said, There's one of my courses that I might train, and then I should pray about it. Oh, no, I don't know how many, how many, how many remember? He was, I said, they said, lab, lab, lab. Intensify. This must be God. Uh, please, my name is Joel, and then I'm reading biochemistry. So, uh, th that's last semester. A service like this before exams, and then I was ushering outside, and daddy came outside and said, there's one of my courses that I um, might train, and then I should pray about it. Oh, no, I don't know how many, how many, how many remember? He was, I said, they said, lab, 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 lab. He said, yes, yes. their course. I said that course, I'm saying that the enemy wants to bring what? A trail in it, but it's what? He cancel it. Yes. So we, when we started the exams, we, we finished, and then there was a break two night after the exams. And then when we went for the break two night, Daddy again said it in breakthrough night, and then he said that he asked me of my class. He, he mentioned the class, and I said yes. And he said he's seen that there is an orchestration that wants to bring me down. So he said, he prayed for me, and he said, I should pray. So when we went for the vacation, I just continued praying for mercy, that God should help me. So when we came back, fast forward, when the results were released, the course that I was to trail, I had many A's, but the course that I was to trail was the highest A for can, all of us. Oh my God, oh. This God, this God. The course that my prophecy was picked up Prayed against God embarrassed the devil rather. It became your highest cause. It, became, it became a highest A. The highest A. Yes, but I, I A's, but that was the highest. Highest A. a. Yes, Come I, on. And I increase in my CWA. You increase also. Yes. Glory be to God in the highest. Oh. I testify. This must be. And on their lights, be on your feet. You have heard their testimonies. This is your time. Lift up your hands. Inside, outside, lift up your hands. Jesus. The same grace is available. What you saw, what you heard, it's now your time. Scholarships, down to jobs, down to increasing CWAs. This is your time. Lift up your hands. Lift up your hands. Now, we are taking a first prayer point. This for the student. You are praying to God. Any curse of failure from my mother's side, my father's side, affecting my excellence in academics, as I begin to pray right now, may it be broken by grace. I ready at all. Say, my father, my father. As I begin to pray, any curse of failure from my mother's side, my father's side, place on my academics, place on my academics, as I begin to pray, by grace, by grace, let that curse be broken. Let that curse be broken. Lift up your voice and pray right now. Yes. Lift up your voice and pray right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. 
in the mighty name of Jesus. The name of Jesus. Any curse, any curse, any curse place of academics. Lift up your voice and pray. Make it break a bottle of Skitaraba. Rabba Baba 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 Lift up your voice and pray. 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 Lift up your voice and Lift up your voice and pray in the name of Jesus. Any curse placed on your academics that you not do well, that you not excel in the name of Jesus. Let it be broken. Let it be broken. Let it be broken. Let it be broken. In the name of Jesus. Let it be broken. Lift up your voice and pray. Celebrate I prophesy. Any case. Please. Any case. Any curse that has been placed on my academics to restrict me from excelling in the name of Jesus. That curse be broken. Now hear me carefully. There are many people, many, many, many people that have encountered in my few years work with God as a man of God in a student community. Who will come to you and then genuinely they learned. Genuinely they wrote. But the results that came out, they have no idea. They have no idea. And some will weep, some will cry, some will be depressed. Daddy, please, I know. No, I, I, I wrote. No. Then different results. We had a young man in this ministry that he was in first class. Now, he came back from the house to school. And then he had a dream. Now someone had a dream about him. And one of the courses, he had the word 26. A dream. They were about to, about to release their course. I mean, I mean their results. And then he told me and I said, you know what? Go to what? Go to the, the examiner. And then go and, go and talk to him that you know, you want to really see your, your mark before what? Before the, I mean, I mean, before they release it. So he said, no, that if I go, this man, I said, you go, my friend. He said, go, go. You are praying, but you go. He, when he went there and asked for the what? Asked for the, the mark. Sir, how was the, I mean, what was the mark? He, no. When he went and asked for the mark, what was there? It was about 37 or so. 37. And he said, no, sir, please. No, this is not, no, sir. Please, I beg you. This is not my resource. He said, it's your resource. Whose name is this? He said, me. That's your resource. The guy refused. He said, no, it's not mine. It's not mine. They now went to check. He had what? 70 what? 76. 76. But it was what? 37. If not God that stepped in that, it was seen and it was, it was shown, shown the way. You will pray right now. Any resource they are cooking for me, any resource they are cooking for me on any altar, catch fire. Any resource they are cooking for me,
you for me on any altar, cut fire. Say, I decree and declare in the name of Jesus. As I begin to pray, any resource, the enemy, my house witches are cooking on any altar to be given to me. I declare, cut fire, cut fire, cut fire. Lift up your voice and pray. Hey! Any resource. Zeke tiki manu waka pana daba, rape benda beka pana daba daba, zeke tiki benda beka pana daba daba, rapa pa. Any resource, any resource, fire, 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 fire. Benda daba beka pana daba daba, rapa pa. Rapa pa 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 Sakaba, <laughs> Any resource looking for me, scatter my fire. Jesus. I prophesy any resource that's been cooked in the COVID in the marine world to be given to me in the name of Jesus scatter by fire scatter by fire say I prophesy anyone on any altar who is speaking against my resource my excellence in academics let their voices be muted in the name of Jesus anyone consulting river goddess anyone consulting mountains consulting mediums malams consulting witchcraft to hold me down academically I declare by grace by grace scatter by grace scatter the name of Jesus say I decree and declare this season I will excel academically not by might not by power by my spirit say the Lord the name of Jesus now you declare right now some people you have to start but they have courses that they have already written your name as what as trailed candidate you will declare any course that's having me as a trail candidate I cancel my name I do what I cancel how I wish this be through night the way I want to prophesy but we we'll put it what on breakthrough night say I decree and declare any course that has me as a candidate as a candidate who has trailed that course the name of Jesus I can't say my name I can't say my name in the name of Jesus the name of Jesus in this season I receive grace I receive grace I override I override resources of the enemy for me in this exam 
in the name of Jesus. Now we are praying right now for the for the workers too. You are praying. Some of you, you have nine CV. It is not being useful at all. You are praying. My degree, my CV, any qualification that, that I have right now, be useful. Be what? Be useful. And on breakthrough night, you will bring your passport, you will bring your CVs. I mean, you those that are believing God for jobs, for master, whatever. Bring those documents. Amen. Would you do what be say father. Say father. father. The name of Jesus. In my career path, every gift, qualifications that I have in the name of Jesus. From today, may it be useful. May it be useful. Some of you, you you know, you are worth more than you receive. You know, you you, you are too qualified. You have first degree, no job you are teaching and they are paying you thousand cities. No. You are worth more than that. The degree must be useful. It must be what? All the qualifications, the first class, it must be useful. You will pray right now. My degree, my qualifications in the name of Jesus, in this nation, across the globe, be useful to my career. So I decree and declare the name of Jesus, my degree, qualifications, giftings, abilities, be useful to my career across the globe. Be useful to my career across the globe. Lift up your voice. One prayer, one prayer. Pray, 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 pray. My qualifications be useful, be useful. My degree be useful. In the name of Jesus. Alabakasata. La ba 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 ra ga da ba ba. Be useful, be useful, be useful, be useful, be useful, be useful. Le ba 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 ra ga da ba ra ba ra ba ka da ba. Be useful, be useful, be useful, be useful, be useful, be useful. Le ke de be be le ke de ba ra ga da ba. Se le be ke te be be ba ra ga da ba ya. Rabba the name of Jesus. My degree will not be a bed in my hands. My certificate will not be a burden in my hands. In the name of Jesus. Say any curse of unemployment placed on my destiny, on my career path, scatter by fire. Scatter by fire. In the mighty name of Jesus. My degree, my qualifications, it will be useful in the name of Jesus.